guys, it's Queen Nita, and in today's video, I will be reacting to the final episode of season two of the Quintessential Quintuplets. Let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. No, oh my god, Miku, no, oh, baby. But you can be Ichigo, baby. I know she kind of hunters on and you know that that's one of my other favorite VAs. So I mean, mm, that's a little hard, but Miko, you got this, honey bunny. <laughs> oh my God, Nino. <laughs> It's just because you're scared, babe. And it's okay to be scared. We've all been that. I want my nails painted that color. suits you honestly she looks so pretty like as much as I love her with long hair short hair is good mm -hmm. <sighs> yeah but Ichika you shouldn't do this. I love the fact that we got no opening and we're just going right into this bitch. Oh. Are we finally going to realize like you know, maybe it was Ichika, maybe it was Miku, it was one of them girls, like, Jesus! <laughs> oh. It had to be you, Ichika. Mm -hmm. Stop lying. But why are your eyes like that, though? Okay, then let's see it. complicated romance drama.
Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, shouldn't you apologize to her? This is so fucking awkward. Yeah, you can't keep avoiding him like this. You have to face him head on. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because all five of y'all got a damn crush on him, and this is hard to choose because it's just like. Mm. Yeah, he's gone, babe. Yeah, because who knows which one he's going to pick. Is it weird that Ichiko was smiling like y'all like y'all can be up with this bitch? So, was he actually in group E? Of course you would do that, Ish. Because you need to talk to Potato. No. Oh. Hmm. Ish. Talk to him. No, you got this. Oh. Told you. Is everybody here? <laughs> no, 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 no.
but I mean, he has a right to know, though. I mean, you keeping this secret from him. I don't know, like, do something. Yeah, they do. Look how heavy! I know. <laughs> but yeah, good job that you had it, even though it's probably for yourself. Nothing. What well, damn, you ate a hole? You can't just savor it?
But you got to talk to him. Can we please just hug it out? I mean, not shade me. <laughs> Oh. 
it is. Oh, hey, Chiba. Really? There is no way in hell they're just going to go ahead and spoil it. I mean, we know this is... It's already confirmed for a third season, but they're not... <laughs> it's one of them. That's all. Time out, time out, time out, time out, time out. Hold everything. So, wait, 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 wait. There's one moment where, you know, you, you give me, you know, my bell coon, Hestia vibes, where, yes, they kissed, they kissed, but then you give me your Ichiga, and oh, I'm confused right now. What is this? What is this? What is this fuckery? What is this fooling me right now? Mm -mm. Okay, season three coming out this year, later on this year, because please, mm -mm. we, I need, I need answers, like, right the fuck down, I mean, mm. explain, <laughs> okay, so final thoughts on the second season, honestly, I think I liked it a lot more than season one, I think relatively for the art style, I think the art style for season two was a lot better, I mean, I don't know, who made what company um, made season one. But season one was really, really good for the art style. But I think with this one, everything just popped. And popped in a good way. It's kind of like when I watched um, season one of Working. And I was like, oh, this is cute. I like the style of it. And then I got to season two and it was like, hey, big old makeover. Like, here you go. We all look nice and good in HD. And I was like, damn, this show pops like so damn well. And it sparkles and it's nice and it's pretty. Woo, y'all got that budget in. But, okay. Um, so the fact is, it was Yotsuba. Yotsuba met him first. And then Yotsuba went back to the hotel, talked to the rest of the girls about him. And, of course, you know, Ichika's walking down. And she fell in love with him right then and there. I mean, hey, you know, that, I don't know why. I can't believe I'm about to say this. That's, that's some fairy tale shit, man. Not, not like fairy tale the anime, but, you know, like fairy tale shit like that. But, I mean, you never know what could happen. You walk somewhere, you lock eyes with someone, and you think you're never going to see them again. And then, bam, you see them somewhere, and the next thing you know, you date. And then, 
like I said, fairy tale, a happily ever after, right off into the freaking sunset, like a damn Disney movie, and then the rest of us over here are like, really? Like, <laughs> like what the fuck? But, okay. I, I Like I said, I really enjoyed this season. This kind of answered a lot of the questions that I had wondered by the end of season one, when the show officially uh, finished, and how, like, they were going to start season two, where was it going to go, and everything. But, like, I mean... Can we talk about how, like, ruthless, and I really loved how she did this, Nino did this, like, she, Nino and Ichika, they were very, very ruthless, and I really gotta, you know, fucking applaud their VAs for doing this, because, like, Jesus Christ, like, I I mean, like, as someone who has not read the manga, um, don't wanna read it, because I don't wanna know spoilers and shit, I mean... These two were ruthless, especially with Nino. I mean, it was really for both on both sides, especially, you know, when they're both confronting Miku, Miku and when Nino's saying, you know, I like him, I'm going to go for him. And almost like saying, like, you know, I don't care what you think, but, you know, I like him too, so I'm going to I'm gonna shoot my shot just as much as every, every other freaking guy, girl, whoever, you know, when it's always one guy, one girl, you know, it's like, mm, we're going to try this bitch. But, I, I mean... I love how what this show did every week because there was all there was always a time where one moment I was Team Nino, I was Team Ichiga, I was Yotsuba, I was Miku, I was Itsuki. Every week I was going back and forth with somebody, and then I think when Nino, like even though Nino has been my best girl since like season one, her and Itsuki, like really everybody's my best girl with this damn show. But I think Nino was the one like predominantly who I loved the most, mainly because of her VA and then a couple other things. Because her VA is known for always playing a Cinderella character and she just like amazing and such. But still with everybody else because no matter what, we were always going back and forth. And then, you know, this shit that Ichika did. Yes, I'm still fucking pissed about that because that is like a freaking... That, that's a girl code. Not only a girl code, but that's a sister code. Like, damn. And... <laughs> I mean, because if she... Like, I, okay. If it was a true family, like, come on. Like, you know, like, typical families are... If you've seen, like, reality TV shows and stuff, or maybe even in your own families, if it's, like, two... If it's a brother or if it's two sisters versus the one guy, you, you know, possibly the sisters are going to fight over him. The best friends are going to fight over the guy, girl, whoever, because, you know, not a, well, men, well, women, we are catty sometimes, but I don't know how, you know, how it go with men, you know, men just do... <laughs> <laughs> I've seen some guy fights and let me tell you, bruh, like, like mm, <laughs> crazy. But I, like, I was expect, I wasn't expecting, like, them to do fist fights because of the fact is, yeah, of course it's family and things, but when you really think about it, like, if it was in real life, yes, you know something like that. It would have ended with a physical altercation with one of them because, of course, there's going to be a point in time where one sister is going to be like, you know what, I had enough of this shit. We're just going to fight with her. <laughs> we going to talk with our fists. And-ish. But honestly, this was really good. I, I-, I don't under. I, I don't. Oh, God. I like the way it ended. I mean, it still gives an open ending, but just the way that looks, it looks like it's Ichika getting married to him, but then, you know, there, he's at the, the bell thing and stuff, and, you know, Itsuki has to your best girl, Chino, like, let's go up in there, runs over to freaking Futaro Balcon, and, like, they kiss and shit, and I'm like, what the frick is going on? Like, I am so confused, and I bet you, I'm gonna go ahead and ask this, did that happen in the manga, or is that just, like, an anime-only ending thing? Like for season two but wherever the heck they're gonna go in season three honestly right now who whoever that is on that last team who kissed Futado right now everybody is on the same playing field however the heck season three is going to go and who is going to be that one who ends up with him I mean whoever it is I mean good job that's all I can say but even with Miku, like, she's playing, like, I love this, I love this. And then she points at Futato and says, like, I love you. And, like, like yeah, like, yeah, Miku, like, yes, you've been wanting to say this. And uh, and then she's like, no, I met my family. And I'm like, girl, you know that a damn lie. <laughs> that is such a lie. But whether it was for him or it was for, sis- for her sisters, he'll never know. Of course, but... 
this was a wild ride and honestly i loved it so much i cannot wait to see what the heck is going to be in store for season three what are the troubles and ish like something still tells me that yosuba is going to tell futaro that it was her actually all along of when they met when they were kids possibly even though she's like she told itsuki like no he, he doesn't need to know it now but like still at the same time he has a right to but or maybe he'll figure it out on his own i don't know but we gotta wait until season three but other than that guys that is my reaction video towards the second season of the quintessential quintuplets if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also uh, subscribe to my channel i make videos every single day join the Matchless squad and of course i will see you guys whenever the heck season three it will come out and then officially what next week because i think next week is the start of april so aka the start of spring anime but until then i will see you guys all next time bye